further proving that Donald Trump is going to be the most ineffective president the United States has ever had, it appears that members of his team can't even speak about important issues the administration is facing without their erratic boss flying off the handle. Trump's own White House officials basically avoid bringing up the topic of Russian interference during intelligence briefings because Trump goes nuts every time it's mentioned. According to the Washington Post, Members of Trump's National Security Council will do almost anything to make sure that Russia does not come up in meetings, or else they will have to be on the receiving end of Trump's rage. One former intelligence official told the Washington Post, If you talk about Russia, meddling, interference that takes the president's daily briefing off the rails. Because Trump's behavior is so unstable and inappropriate, his team has to waste time finding creative ways to slip Russia-related intelligence subjects into the briefings disguising them as little bullet points and keeping them out of any oral presentations. This is absolute madness, and it gets even crazier. If Russia is brought up during oral presentations, this is what Trump's CIA analyst has to do to shield Trump's fragile feelings. Trump's main briefer a veteran CIA analyst suggests the order of his presentation and text, aiming to soften the impact. What the heck? Trump has some very serious mental issues if his entire team is being forced to work around his emotional state in order to avoid his wrath. Trump's anger over Russia continues to be a pattern, as Trump is still defending Russia and denying that it played any part in his victory in the 2016 election. He continues to stand by Vladimir Putin, saying, Every time he sees me, he says, I didn't do that. And I believe, I really believe, that when he tells me that, he means it.